Welcome back to Central Valley Talk. Uh, is it possible to do business during COVID? Are we all out of work? Can anybody work at home? What shall we do? What shall we do? Well, we've been looking around the valley for people doing creative things and cool things and surviving through the COVID. And our next guest, Joey Halar. I'll probably say the name all wrong, but we'll get to that later. Joey, welcome to the show. We appreciate Hi. you very much. And uh, are you still in business? Yes, I am. Surviving through the COVID. Now, you do illustrations and graphic design. Tell us about yes. that. Well, while I also do graphic design for, like, so for brands right now, like, currently I'm doing video and web design. I and, like, also do branding. Uh -huh. I also do murals also, like, illustration. So I'm open to, like, any, like, art, any art. So... Recently, I did murals in Venice Beach and Santa Monica. Oh my goodness! So, wow. And were those murals? Yes. Are they on uh, public places? I see the pictures. Look at that! Wow. Are they at a restaurant <laughs> or at a park or a public place? One was in the alley, the one when you saw the blue and all the people there. Okay. And then the other one was in the hotel, the Comfort Inn in Santa Monica. Okay. That's beautiful. Those colors are great for the beach communities. Yes. Oh, and I see you did one around a swimming pool. Yes, that one. I like that a lot. Oh, and and the recent before those two, my mural was displayed. It's currently displayed in Kings Canyon and Walmart. Oh, Walmart and Kings so. Canyon. Okay, outside. Inside. I, inside. Yes. Well, I go to that Walmart sometimes. I'll go there just to see the art. Yes, that's what I did. <laughs> very nice, very nice. Now, I guess people could or do commission your work. They hire you to come do this stuff, right? Yes. Because uh, sometimes it's nice to have a mural even inside the home. I've seen that a lot. Oh, wow. Yeah. It was a challenge because I know there were some that are like, I was about to do theirs, and then there's a lot of setbacks, so, and I completely understand during time, but... I guess that I moved on when a lot when some are like asking me to to, to paint to, to make create a mural. Uh -huh. So I was excited. I was like, okay, let's hop in. Nice. <laughs> so, Is that the yeah. biggest stuff you've done? Uh, largest format? Yes, actually, this year was my first. Like actually, it was my first time. Someone was asking us, "Is this your first time doing murals?" Like, yes, actually, I didn't believe it because they think it's just from a canvas. But hey, it was my ex my not only my first time experience, and it's my first time. It's like, actually, you did a good job on it. Yeah. So. <laughs> and are you using oil paint? I don't even know what you would use. Um. During my time, I used to do like oil paint and acrylics. But this one, when you're in outside in extreme like weathers or in the humidity, such as in the beach, you need like those foam paint or with primer uh -huh. to um or, like you know just to keep the paint there so it won't fade. Okay, so yeah. uh, just house paint. Paint you use to paint a house. Yes. Okay. All right. Well, let's bring things down to a more reasonable size. Now you do uh uh. uh uh, graphic design for companies. Do you do logo designs? Tell us about that part of your business. Like also, every brand starts with a logo. So I also research like, and they also tell me what they want in their brand and what they're hoping to achieve. So it always starts from a small logo and then goes through their um, to their website to their business. And then I always ask, what is your mission and your values and how will that attract your customers of interest? So, and then I follow suit and take notes to that. Okay. Now, let's say somebody's watching and says, wow, what an artist. I want to get a hold of her to, to do a mural or to create my brand or help me design my logo or the web pages. Where do they start in reaching you? Do you have a web website? Yes. Uh, for, I should have wrote right down it. It's online. That's at JoMareStudio.com, or you could look at my Instagram at JoMareArts. Actually, it's on the screen right now through some magic <laughs> of technology. Joy, Joy Mare, like M-A-I-R-E. Yes. 
joemayerstudio.com or it's mm -hmm. one word joe mayer or joe mayer art on instagram just type joe mayer you'll find it it'll pop up somewhere right <laughs> Now yeah. we, have, we have some of your beautiful uh, logos and stuff. Oh, this is a website. This is stuff that's on your website. You probably can't oh my see. Oh gosh, it's on live. So you have to like cover each one of them. Uh-huh. And each one shows a different set of words that I've done. Nice, I see one sort of almost a, 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 a restaurant or a, a place where it looks like one that's in Visalia, a place people go. Oh, you recognize yeah. that one. Yeah, what do you call that? Wait, what do you call that kind of building? Uh, uh, hamburger stand or something like that? You yes, that's like, um, remember the Merle's in Visalia? Merle's, that's what it was, yeah. That's beautiful. So, so I turned to Habit Grill. So oh, I, it's Habit now? Ah. Now, is that watercolor? What is your medium? Um, it was color pencil first, and then I edited it in Photoshop. Ah. So I just like to pop the colors more of the paint. And yeah. that's my Jo Mayer art. So, that's a web page Instagram. Instagram that's the Instagram yeah. <laughs> Very nice. well listen I encourage all of our viewers just go, I mean even if, even if you don't need to commission art it's just fun place to go look at her art it's like an art hop right there on the screen of the uh, of your computer joemayerstudio.com it's on our screen Joe M A I R E studio.com or same thing on Instagram Joe Mayer art uh, anything else you want our viewers to know? We want you to come after COVID right here to our studio and show off some of your stuff. <laughs> sure. That would uh, be great. <laughs> uh, and there, have... Anyway, we're running out of time. Anything else you want our viewers to know? Mm. How about... um, oh, um, no, that's all I have. So I'm open to a variety of art. So okay. whether photography, painting, or graphics, and you're also yeah. um, going to do those. Well, I recommend anybody to, oh, we see some of the photography now on the screen, but I recommend to anybody, go to her joemayerstudio.com or Joe Mayer Art on Instagram. Check out these photos. If you need some photos done, you need some art done, you need a mural done, you need some graphic arts done, um, logo, web page, anything. Call uh, call our friend uh, Joy at Joe Mayer Art. And uh, if you didn't write down or you don't remember how to reach her, call me here at Central Valley Talk. I'll give you the web address. I'll give you the Instagram. We'll put you in touch with her. Um, thank you for coming. We really appreciate you taking your time out during this COVID time. And uh, we want to have you back again and again. Uh, thank you so much. All righty. Nice uh, Stick around, we have more on Central Valley Talk right after this.